At 5.30 in a chaotic scene in Key West when gunshots ring out. Three innocent bystanders are struck when a man opens fire near Duval Street. CBS 4's Ted Scouten live tonight in Key West with what he has learned about the victims and the gunman. What do we know, Ted? Well, Rick, all three of the people who were shot were actually here visiting. They were here on vacation. According to investigators, the actual incident, the, the guy with the gun was down in this area over here. But then we spoke to some other people who said when he started firing, it was down the alley here, down the road, and the people that were shot were hit right there at Duval Street. I was walking down Duval Street last night and I, I got shot. From his hospital bed at the Ryder Trauma Center, Reed Ogden is feeling pretty lucky right now. But 1.30 in the morning, his night of fun in Key West turned to terror. I heard what sounded like, uh, you know, like firecrackers or something. I thought fireworks were going off or something, a little celebration. And um, I ended up seeing a guy run past me and then I heard another pop and that's when my, uh, my forearm went numb. It all began when Reed and a girl he was taking out for the first time were walking down Duval Street, passing Charles Street. It was just down that street in a back alley where police say Derek David from Sugarloaf Key and a woman were arguing and David pushed her to the ground. A couple guys tried to help out. That's when investigators say David pulled out a gun and fired. The four shots, you know, rang out and we just thought it was some snapping. On so, or I thought it was some mats being snapped together, but uh, my girlfriend, she said, was that gunshots? And I said, nah, this is Key West, you know. Those noises were gunshots. No one involved was hit, but Reed and two other innocent bystanders were. I knew something was up with my arm, and it felt like a little heavier and, and numb, but as soon as it happened, we just hauled, and I, I, I'm not really good at seeing my own blood. I can see other people's blood, but when I see my own blood, I start getting a little woozy. So After realizing he was hit, Reed ran looking for help. That's when he ran into Emily. She's trained in first aid. He came upstairs and he's like, I've been shot, I've been shot. So I do what I do and I'm like, okay, you're fine. You're not going to die. Everything is fine. But he was, he, he thought he was dying. Fortunately, no one died. This could have been much worse. Just around the corner, Kenny Chesney fans packed Duval Street, camping out overnight for a free concert at Sloppy Joe's. Was not expecting my keys trip to end up like this, for sure. And everyone who was shot is expected to recover. As a matter of fact, two of them have already been released from the hospital. As for the suspect, he is due in court tomorrow afternoon here in Key West. Live in Key West, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.